I'm Helen Thompson, so I'm talking with Ian Smith from Auckland Council. So Ian, welcome, thanks for joining me. Thank you. So you're a smart community, what does that mean exactly? I mean, for us it means a lot of different things. Um, I'd say we're in the building block phase uh, of the smart community um, sort of build up. At the end of the day, we're here to support and provide services to our citizens. WebGIS is one of the ways that, that, that we do that, um, you know, moving beyond silos of information into sort of um, consistent um, sort of single source of the truth. We can make better decisions as a, as a wider community uh, with that data. And you've come quite a long way in this journey. Can you describe some of that? So um, back in 2010, Auckland Council uh, was formed from a number of legacy organisations. So since then we've been um, focusing on our internal um, systems so we can actually start presenting um, a new consolidated authoritative um, systems of record out into um, our users. I think one of the areas I'm really proud of is our um, open data services that we've, um, we have we launched last year. We've been able to release a lot of our internal data um, for use and reuse. Um, it was a really simple process to get the information um, up online um, and it, we're starting to see some, some benefits where the, the amount of direct data requests are starting to drop as people use their use the sort of self-service tools. Obviously it's becoming very important to communicate our story um, and we've, we're starting to release a number of web apps and web apps to showcase um, what we're doing. I'm also looking at uh, consultation using GIS 3D. Um, to, 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 to engage people around what's happening. This is such an amazing story, but would any of this be possible without ArcGIS? Absolutely not. Um, with a number of different business processes and systems and, and applications we have across Council, there's no way we could have done it without um, ArcGIS to sort of bring it all together into to a seamless ability to, to, to map the data and then start to move beyond the mapping into um, some analysis um, and, and some, some different outcomes. Um, we're, we've got a vision, obviously, to be the world's most livable city, and we've got an overall strategy called the Auckland Spatial Plan. And ArcGIS was essential to allow us to create that plan and also start to move towards that to, 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 to enable it, the, the vision to become a reality. What ArcGIS allows us to do is communicate our story in many different ways, um, whether it's through um, story maps, whether it's through web maps or web apps. Um, so again, it's, the, the suite of products enable us to, to showcase what we're doing. Well, I think you've got an amazing story, um, well-deserved reference. So thank you for being with me. Thank you very much.